Welcome back, gang. It's Deltia from DeltiasGaming.com. And in this video, I'm joined by ESO YouTube legend Hack the Minotaur, who recently just joined PCNA server from Xbox. Hack and I problem solve and duo the veteran dread seller dungeon with simple builds, me and my sorcerer tank, hack on a magpar using a combination of overland and other gear setups. You're going to want to watch this video as we use the mechanics of the dungeon, work with each other to problem solve getting through a tough four player dungeon with just two people. Hack has great builds and you can really tell in this video. Link in the description below if you're not familiar with this channel, I would go recommend checking it out. Let's get started. Real quick, the Sork build that I used is a very simple tank that is all about selfish survivability and sustain. My gear sets that I went with was Engine Guarding for selfish resource sustain, Grace of Gloom for crazy survivability and self-healing, and the Battalion's Defender, another self and group healing set. Battalion's Defender is useful in this specific situation because it not only can heal me, but it can heal Hack, who's playing in melee range as a Magpar. So my goal is just to survive, heal myself and provide as much utility by taunting and controlling the ads as possible this setup does it my bar setup is a very simple bar setup with double barring clan fear that's the main thing that's going to keep me survivable here i also went with sword and shield alt on my front bar the reason why is if you pop it you get to block without the cost of stamina then you can go to your back bar and use dark deal to channel magicka into stamina it's basically an infinite sustain loop along with balance from the mages guild giving you magicka at the cost of health i'll have a full build out on this a little bit later but that's the basic premise of this very survivable not a lot of group utility but it's gonna be hard to kill me unless i screw up of course all right now the dungeon this dungeon is absolutely incredible all-time favorite love i've, I've ran this really? like oh Dude, yeah, you wait till the final boss. It's gonna be a ride. It's 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 hard. It's challenging. Nice. <laughs> Trash packs in these uh, beginning areas. I'll do my best to taunt the priority target that could one shot you and then chains everything in. I'm just gonna keep my build very simple for survivability. They okay, blockade down. Gonna taunt everything again. One, two, three. Reapply blockade. I'm gonna do block. Uh, barrier here just to be safe. Nice barrier. Yeah, it's not even more. Rip. Don't tell anybody. There's a range ad that you can't even chains in. You kind of oh, have to yeah. cheese it. Yeah, so you kind of back up a minute. Usually it'll teleport out of there. I say usually, it probably won't do it now. <laughs> no press. Okay. Um, come here, friend. It's thinking about it. <laughs> it's thinking about it. <laughs> okay. All right, here we go. So what's going to happen, and we might struggle with this one, but there's a bunch of pop-ups that happen. To the left-hand side is a range caster. So what I try to do is taunt the three priority targets, park them on top of the range caster, but just be prepared. They will try to pressure you. So I'll try to grab them all up, and then we'll clump and dump. Kind of the furthest scamp there is where it spawns at. So this this is a tough one. Okay, I'm going to try to get that Ravager. Got okay. him. Nice. Uh, one's loose. One second. Should got him now. Okay, we're good. Okay, got this guy. There we go. All right, we're getting it. <laughs> we're getting nice. it. Nice. <laughs> oh, that's done. Whew. Yeah, that, nice. <laughs> that had back just killed a lot of pugs. So we will be able to get at least one of the secret bosses. I think it has 2 million health, roughly. Not that hard. Just has some ads and stuff. So we'll come up here. And this is kind of a cool little uh, part. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty cool. NPCs get the best animation. <laughs> yeah, right. That's what I always say. Oh, he has 4 million health. Good lord. Okay. Yeah. Um, we're going to be here for a minute. You may want to take out the ads because they may overwhelm us since we're not having four players here. Yeah. Slow and steady. Do you have a um, ritual? Yeah, I'm running uh, the healing one, whatever it's God, called. This thing got a nasty dot. Okay, that'll be very helpful. I'm looking at my resources here, looking good. Sword and boards alt up if I get in trouble. Let's put blockade down. Balance here. I'm gonna go ahead and move the ad, uh, the boss on top of this ad. Dude, this guy has tons of health. Yeah, he's a bag of HP. I think we'll we'll just finish here. All right. I got plenty of magic. I'm just gonna keep it up. Yeah, if you could drop the cleansing circle, I think I'm good. Okay, it's down. perfect. Got it. There's blockade for you. 
<laughs> I almost stopped just doing it. Okay. So if you look at yeah. your um if you look at your uh, stats now in your character screen, you'll see Purgatory Ascension. So we'll get weapon and spell damage increased by three hundred. I, I apparently have the Shadow Munda Stone. That's that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops! Activating the Guardian gives us one minute, and also it summons, uh, it resurrects us. So if one of us gets in trouble, what will happen is we'll have this synergy in place at some point in all of the bosses going forward. And you can add to that. Obviously, we have two players, but you can essentially get to the final boss with three of these that really help you oh, out. Oh, man. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. So how yeah. do you summon it? Oh, I'll show you. Uh, basically, it looks like this on the map, and you walk over into it and click the synergy key, and it just pops oh, up. Oh, sweet. Yeah. All right. So hopefully cool. that'll be our saving grace if we can get through this. Yeah. This boss is really cool, by the way. So 4.5 nice. million health, not too bad, but we have to travel around. You can see right behind her to the right is that yellow crystal. So that's yep. our oh crap button. If I die or you die. The number one thing that we have to do in order to survive this is bash. It'll be like a big red telegraph. It might just take you a time, a second or two to get it. It'll it'll stun you or me. Doesn't matter. Okay. So we kind of have to hang around. So what's going to happen here is here's how to activate the hard mode. We're not going to do that. You see these random, I don't know, broken up crystals with Daedric yeah. writing on. So yep. she'll shoot up in the air at different intervals and go to one of these at random. When that happens, there's going to be a couple of ads. One's going to be melee, one's going to be range. The range has to be interrupted or basically we die. You kind of just go do your own thing while I hold those ads. And then once that's DPS down, you come back. We regroup, kill the ads, work on the boss, rinse and repeat. But they'll introduce that bash mechanic and that's the only way we'll die. So keeping the spear down for me along with the ritual when you're done... Uh, will be very helpful for me also call out if i like miss a, a taunt because it's it's a bit tricky maintaining all that what i'll try to do is bring the crap on top of the crystals if we have enough time then you can dps the crystal boss and the ads at the same time but it might take us a couple times to work through this okay so you said priority is the ranged ad yeah because it's the thing that will one shot okay. us both because it can basically just do this channel where you take a crap ton of damage and we have to bash Got it, it. Got it. But All right, cool. Let's just experience it and see how it goes. By the way, if you're doing the hard mode as a tank, this thing is in the final boss, and it uh, uh -huh. it does all the mechanics, like just completely nukes you, and it's it was one of the hardest things I've ever done as a tank. And wow. Yeah, see this right here? You have to experience that. Blows through your stam. Yeah, I'm going to hit a barrier here. Okay, so here's the ads. One is a melee, and then one is a range. So here's the range one. So we're gonna park boss, yep, on top, perfect. All right, got ritual down. Now, remember, it's pretty uh, melee, non-friendly shock. It's Elder Scrolls Online. Okay, bash right. that if you could help. Got it. Now we're about 80%, so this should be the next mechanic here in a second. Didn't see the melee eye, which is weird. Let me heavy attack a couple times. Okay, should be good. I'm gonna eat this. Okay, let's push her over and get ready for a big red circle and she'll jump in the air. That's it. Okay, now we need to locate the spear and then the other ad comes, the melee yeah. does. Yep. So let's let's worry about the crystal though. Let's move them over. I got this one taunted, yep. So I'm gonna park melee on top of the crystal. Don't don't yeah. worry about the boss per se, we'll just worry about the crystal. Otherwise it empowers the boss. All I'm right. gonna hit a barrier just in case you get in trouble. There you go, nice job. Okay, so let me get the boss. Remember there's heavy AoE here, so just be careful. Yep. Good, 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 good. Looking good, I'm good on stam. Okay, now call out the, this is the mechanic, bash. Oh, and empower the boss. So if we don't meet the DPS check on the crystal, that's what happens. It makes it just a little bit harder. But with one person, we might just have to deal with it. Uh, bash, Going that's up. the bash mechanic. Got it. Nice, good, perfect. So we're at 70, looking real good. Yep, uh, another caster, um, caster up over here, I'm gonna go grab. I'm close to a barrier, one heal if you could. Barrier, thank you. Down. One spear. spear if you could. Perfect bash. Got it. Okay, got him. Nice bash. Good work. Okay, potions up. Looking good. Okay, we're at 62. Same thing. If we can get through this, should be okay. Jeez, that dot. <laughs> when you're taking to the final boss, that dot. <laughs> oh, yeah, I bet. So it's so fun. So 32%. We'll probably have one more phase. Here we go. Add up. I'm going to move in a second now. Um, bash if you could. Oh, it's the caster. Bash the uh, boss. I got it. Got it. Perfect. Okay. Now we're going to show you the mechanic after this. 
Um, so how about you go run and just do it real quick? Throw me a spear if you wouldn't mind. Should be able to survive this. Okay, so just go do it since we're not in trouble. Of course, yeah. it, it does that to you, huh? Sick. There we go. Let's bring it. Oh, sweet. Yeah, and you, you <laughs> hit a synergy too, and it just nukes things. So we, we obviously saved it till the end, but we should be good. Uh, throw me one spear if you could. I'm hurting. Ups, crap, of course. No, no, no. Try to res the melees on you. It's gonna be tough. I'm sorry. Almost, almost. There we go. Oh, nice clutch. Of course, yeah, after we, we use the dang thing, yeah. I'm dropping ult here. Clutched it there. Okay. Blocking. Here we go. It's 500,000. Should be able to execute it here. I got your bash. I got your bash. Thanks. <laughs> just, okay, now I'm hurting. All right. Uh, things casting too. We got it. We got it. We got it. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Hack with the clutch save. Nice job. <laughs> of course, as soon as we summon the stupid thing, I die. I pug out. <laughs> that was a good fight. That was awesome, huh? The, yeah, that's not intended sure. for uh, two people. Okay, this might be a nightmare, but we'll try it. The, the Atronox are kind of a pain. They have like a bash interrupt. They have a million health, but they just keep coming back. So I pretty much just ignore them. And you'll see in the left-hand side is that crystal, our friend crystal, in case we get in trouble. The boss yeah. has 6 million health. It's just a pain in the butt. So Martis here is going to give you an audio cue and block off these red death lines that come. So you kind of uh, keep your camera face this way and we hang out at the center of the back here so we get more time to adjust to the flame, the red death lines. Not too right. bad on non-hard mode. Um, and once we get through a couple of phases, I don't know if it's HP or time, then it'll kind of suck up to the big crystal up top. And that is where skulls come out and they hit like a Mack truck. Do your best to dodge and avoid those or shield or just heal through it, block. And there'll be a tons of little ads. I'll do my best to clump them up in the center. If you like run away from me, it'll be real hard to do, but... Uh, that way we can just drop a Desti in there and try to wipe mm -hmm. those out. Bolt worms are going to be something to deal with. So it's just going to be a challenge. All right. Oh, let's give it a go. Let's do it. All right. Let's pull here. We got this guy. Got this guy. And if the Atros are on, you know, I'm missing the taunt. Just let me know. All right. It's huge, nasty, heavy, and it hits hard. See those, the bash, you can't even really bash them. Now you might want to check your camera here in a second because he'll, he'll start talking. See Martis starts talking yep. and you can look okay. at, yep. So flame, the death line's coming. I'm gonna come over here. Now here's the phase I was talking about. So let me get some stam up. I got the spear, good. Okay, so is this the skull um, it's coming. Yeah, a lot of crap on the ground in the mid, yep. Uh, I bar swap, screw that up. Go grab the sigil just so we can get some practice here. If you bar swap at the wrong time here, you're just dead. Oh, yeah. So yeah, try to save the Destro if you could for that exact phase. So, okay. so many of those little guys are just really tough to deal with. But Oh, I see the sigil. It's up top. Yeah, okay. and you should be able to access it just at the base, but that was a good attempt. My bad, I screwed up. Do you want me to kill the worms or just leave them? Um, if you can, usually whoever they're attached to gets a bonus thing. So it's usually I need to deal with it if it's mine. I'm going to dodge this thing, clear over here. I'm going to do some dark deals. Get some taunts back, it. one second. Okay, here we go. This is a tough part. Okay, ritual, spear. Going to drop Destro. Okay, everything should be taunted, ready to go. Barrier out. I'm going to get re-taunted nice. everything. Looking good. Okay, get ready. Death line's coming. Right. Artist from Stead middle, so we should be good. I'm going to tap a few times. Dodge. Spears out. Okay, resources looking good for now. Not bar swapping here. <laughs> okay, I almost got a Destro. I'll hold it. Yep, here just comes the face. Let me get the critters in just a second. Um, okay, the spear's up. There they go. Oh, okay, I'll stun you too. I'm nice. getting them one second, one second. Yeah. Barrier now. Nice. Nice. Nice job. I just got an achievement. Greater uh, dungeon blocker. It's going on the mantle. <laughs> I got Destro whenever we need it. Here we go. Um, I'm to wait for the dogs here in a second. Let me re taunt everything back. Okay, looking good. Debuffing boss. Range taunting the critters. 
Okay, drop in the Block crate. Blockade on the critters. I'm in trouble. Okay, I'm good. Get the boss back. Getting there. We're getting there. <laughs> don't, don't jinx it. I screwed up last time. <laughs> okay, 7%. Looking good. Yep, I'm good. I'll get these two. Come on. Drop my DB on his head. Yeah, bag of HP. Nice. Woo, got her down. Yeah, man. <laughs> Slow and steady. Just one screw up, too. It's going pretty good. Sweet. We didn't even use the... Um... Oh, yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I'm like, let's not use it in case I pug out and bar swap. Don't jinx it. <laughs> this dungeon actually goes really fast once you get used to the mechanics and you don't do the secret bosses. Because oh, yeah. you can see the secret bosses at a lot of the time. But if you can get through the mechanics, four players... I'm just blow through this thing. Now the hard modes are hard. Nice. That Shadow Mundus is working for you. <laughs> but yeah, big, big crit deals, huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I got to go change the Shadow Mundus. Like, oh, that's epic. What? I mean, I didn't even PvP with Shadow Mundus. I don't need PvE with Shadow Mundus. Did I just misclick it or something? <laughs> God. Exposed. Okay, get ready. You ready? Right. I, I recommend ready. no UI for this entrance here, okay? Okay. What? <laughs> How cool is that? Oh, this is the final boss already? This is the final boss, yeah. Is that not like a, like yeah. Goro on uh, Mortal yeah, Kombat? Yeah. So no hard mode on this guy. 8 million health. So what we're going to do is come over here. It's going to be slow and steady. And um, there's going to be two phases that are going to be tough for both of us. At 65% health and 35. We have to go back here. Now there's a DPS race we're probably not going to do, which is going to empower it kind of what we've already seen. We're going to go in here and try to kill the crystal if we can. When we come out of the crystal at 65% health, we're going to have a new mechanic where there's big, huge flame lines. So as a tank, I pretty much kind of play around this area. Reason being is we're, we don't want to run and take a bunch of dot damage, get into the synergy. And when I come mm -hmm. out, the only, there'll be a gap right here that you can get into. Otherwise, the entire room will have this rotating flame wave. So you have to kind of come mm -hmm. in here as a group or individual to get by that and then reset. There's crap okay. everywhere. There's gonna be ads, little scamps that actually have a bag of HP. I'll try to taunt them and put them on top of the boss. And then uh, you can see the synergy clear across the map because of course it is. So we'll, right. we'll hang on to that. So 8 million health, we'll just have to <laughs> maintain focus. And then there will be a phase where it kind of uh, shoots out a huge red line that covers almost the entire map except out here. But I, I can eat it as a tank. You probably not. So usually I'll just bring okay. the boss to the just edge. Move out. Yeah. You probably right. just have to experience it. But red's bad. Let's kill stuff. Do it. Comes the friends. So I'll do my best to change them up. So this block, whole block or dodge, you'll have a nasty debuff. We'll just have to work through it. Okay, all my friends should be there. Okay, this is what I was talking about. You can eat it as a DPS, but... Oh, it's it, pretty it, easy to dodge. Yeah, and leaves two uh, things on the ground. So same thing here. Just rinse and repeat till 65%. It's a bag of HP. I'm just going to hold it right here since you got uh, melee. Right, 69. So let's go ahead and push the boss over. I'm going to bring him over at 65. Remember, oh, here's the critters. Dang it. Let's go ahead and kill the critters if we can. Might, otherwise, it'll be a pain to deal with. All right, I'm locking him in place here. Blockade on him. Boss might be loose. I got him. I'm going to barrier just in case. At 60, get ready. The Might push the boss over accidentally. Yeah, we did. Okay, uh, with me. Uh, heal yourself if you can. Hit this. Smash that synergy key. There should be an ad or a spinny flame thing. I, I forget which one this is. Yep, spinny flame thing. Like Vatishram, kind of. Okay. Move with it. Yep. So just try your best to do damage. Watch. Block that. Block that. Block that. Uh, okay, got the, got the bone thing. Again, yeah, okay. it's, a, it's a time thing. Do your best and... I don't think we can get it down, but this is not spinny. It's just isolated. Okay. Yeah. So but it'll be tough for me here when we come out. So remember, when we come out, we're going to have that uh, new flame line mechanic. So I got the two uh, ads. I'm parking them here. Boss is good. So as soon as the explosion goes off, we should have that, what I was talking about. It'll, it'll be right on top of the boss. Okay, there it is. Yep. So that's going to add a layer of complexity barrier here. The scorion has been powering the boss. Um, since we're two players, it's pretty much all we can do. Okay, now we're going to have to you know, rotate around with me. And then we're going to go in the center. I could use one heal if you can. Gotcha. Okay, good. Now, that's just basically it. Um, right. So if you could put a cleansing circle down. Good. 
Okay, just be careful not to overlap. Okay. We're gonna rotate around. There Same thing. Okay, so we're getting control of everything again. I'm gonna bring the boss by the uh, synergy. Where is the yellow one? Okay, good, good. We're getting through it. Yep, yep, getting back control. Okay, we're good. Um, damn, it's a lot of flame. Okay. I'm gonna pull him back a little bit to the edge in case that next mechanic comes, you can still DPS him. All right, here we go, ads. We got it. Stay in. Okay, oh, here we go, three, two, one, ow. Nice, yep. Okay, barrier just in case. Yep, just keep hitting that synergy on cooldown. Let's rotate around. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Watch out, watch out. Okay, let's, uh, we're gonna dodge four times here. Uh, I'm not gonna be able to make it, I don't think. Okay. Stan. This is hectic. <laughs> we almost got it. Come on. <laughs> Come on. There you go. There you go. <laughs> there nice. we go. <laughs> nice. Yeah, two man there. Wow. Nice job. Yeah, nice job. Let's see what, what monster challenge you get. I got bow of agony and I got the heavy. Oh, you got heavy? Dang, I got heavy too. Okay. Well fitted heavy. Well fitted heavy. Man. That was pretty good, man. I mean, it only took us yeah. it only took us an hour to two man it. Not bad. Not bad. Yeah, I mean that trash bowl at the very beginning was uh, one of right. the hardest parts of it, but I think it worked pretty good. The synergy with the the sword tank and the mag bar really worked. Yeah, that cleansing circle, yeah. which was huge, along with the spears, really helped me. Yeah, extra heals, definitely. All right, we gotta get a screenshot. All right, three, two, one. Magma incarnate deleted. Looks good, man. Yeah, well. Yeah, GG. Good job, Thanks, man. Dude. Hell of a player. Appreciate it. Thanks for uh, inviting me to play. It's a fun. Yeah, man. We'll have to do it again. All right, brother. Thanks again. All right. Bye. Take care. Well, gang, that's a dungeon run, and we got through it, well, surprisingly easily. What was amazing to me was that the Sorcerer Tank and the Templar combo really played well off each other. Hat giving me resource sustain and a cleanse, while I could just burst heal myself like crazy and hold down the ads. Again, special thanks to Hack the Minotaur for joining me. Link in the description below to check out his channel, as he has a ton of great videos and content, so please stop by and give him a look. And I appreciate him joining. Thanks for watching.